Welcome to Alms! coming tonight to our Alms for Young Adults second annual benefit dinner. So here's your MC for the evening. I would like to call Betty to come up. In the last 20 years, I have traveled or lived throughout the entire western part of the United States. My story isn't pretty, but it's my story. And it doesn't really matter how terrible a story sounds if the ending is good. And so far, it's going pretty well. <laughs> but I'm not done yet. My goal is to make my story a difference in this world, helping people in need like I was and some ways still am. And if I'm lucky, I won't have too many more regrets. <laughs> I hope my story will help you understand how much young people like me need your support. I have been abused physically and emotionally, used, a suicidal, a cutter, homeless, and hungry. To me, there's only two paths. One, I can let my pain consume me and I can stay in the streets. Or two, I can rise up and fight to make myself the best I can be. I know for a fact that if I had not met Alms, I would have not chosen to rise and I would not be where I am today. Thank you for listening and letting me share. Please help me welcome Ed. I would like to thank all you guys for coming tonight, and it's important and it means a lot to us. Um, we're asking you to please, please support us with your dollars tonight. And with the with the auction and the wine, it's it's good for you and for us. <laughs> not not the wine. I'm too young for that, but. Um, we hope you enjoy your meal and your dessert, and uh, please don't forget about us. Let's have a warm welcome for Miss Jane Williams, Executive Director of Alms. We need you in whatever fashion you want to support us, whether it's opening doors for us to come in and 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 letting those young people know that they are valued, that they have value, that they have gifts and talents and skills that they've never seen and maybe no one in their family has ever seen, but we see it, we know it's there, we wanna find it, we wanna bring it out, and then we want them to shine. We always have a student of the year, and last year Carolina was our student of the year, but this year we have a new year, a new student. And so we're gonna ask Betty, Miss Betty, come on down, girl. I think you would agree that she might be the student of the month, a student of the year, would you? And we just want to thank you for being amazing, awesome. And that was an am amazing story, was it not? She wrote, she wrote it. I realized a long time ago that if you're making a difference in one life, it's worth waking up for. But if you're making a difference in a community, Yes? If you're making a difference in the next generation of leaders, right? So would you all help me and help our team make a difference with All Leaders Must Serve? So these two ladies are people we see every day, personal mentors of ours. Um, and we have a beautiful flowers to give both of them. Personally, Miss Dawn helps me with personality tests and like you guys heard, help me show my strengths and whatnot. I would thank both of them um, for helping me from every step of my life since I met you guys. Helping me achieve my goals, even though 
I haven't achieved my goal yet. I'm in the process and that's where it means a lot to me. And it's just, I don't see them as my mentors. I see them more like my mom because they give me all the support that I need. And I love my mom. She's a big supporter too. But it's just, it's wonderful having them too, not just as your mentors, as your mom. But even though they're not our babysitters, I don't mean it like that. I mean it as like, they show you the love, the support, they believe in you, they don't leave you alone. They will help you get through it all and they won't stop. They will do whatever they can to help us achieve our goal. And that means a lot to me. So give them a big round of applause, please.